your hands and you allow yourself to start thinking three more and we can win this division? Only if we're idiots, you know. I mean, what we got to do is worry about next week. So I, I hope we're going to idiots on our team. We'll, we'll talk about that tomorrow. But we're, you know, we got a tough game coming in here next Saturday. I know that. At the end of the game, and Hemingway made a catch in the, end, in the back of the end zone. What do you think he was in? It, it looked, you know, and I got the worst seat in the house. It looked from where I, I was standing that uh, it looked like he came down on the white, and then seeing the replay made me feel a little bit better. There. Your 24 hour rule, how it, uh, hard is it to get a team to buy into that on Sunday or Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday? It was hard last week, and it'll probably be hard this week you know, for a different reason. And uh, that's, that's one of the tricks I think anybody involved in sports would, would talk about. But, uh, you know, I want guys to enjoy things too. It's okay to feel bad. Last week we deserved to feel bad, and we earned that. And uh, this week's the flip. You know, these guys earned a, a chance to really feel good about themselves. They should be proud of their effort. And, you know, we'll learn tomorrow. And uh, you know, when they get up Monday morning, so it's a little bit more than 24 hours. I guess they get up Monday morning, and we got to flip the page because we had another, another tough challenge here. Did they have that Minnesota loss behind them when Tuesday's practice started? Uh, I, you know, I doubt it. You'd have to ask our players, but uh, I think it was lingering with all of us a little bit. And that's you know, losses uh, stay longer typically. Uh, wins the state longer with the mature teams, but I don't think we have an immature team right now. Is it, was the approach is the approach any different uh, in the week after a game like that? Well, yeah, I mean, obviously it is. You know, it's uh, yeah, the psyche of a team and, and uh, you know where they're at. It's different. And it's not just wins and losses. It's time of the year, circumstances. You know how much uh, uh, you know how much flex, uh, shrapnel flying around out there, that type of thing. So you know those kinds of things. But it's you know that's part of the deal. Just handle every week uh, uh, as it comes, and try to try to do your best to evaluate, and then uh, and do what we can. You guys forced a couple of big turnovers. Can you just talk about how important that was? Yeah, they, they were critical. I mean, uh, you know, we, we pr you know, prefer to come up with. Uh, I think we got the ball in the 31. We better come out with the touchdown. But at least we came up. Mike Meyer had a big field goal there, and uh, that, was, that was not easy. You know, so that was a big play. And then certainly on the other end of the field, uh, you know, coming up with the turnover. So Michigan didn't have a chance to get the three or seven. That was, that was a big thing, too. Okay, thanks. Thanks, Steve.